Hi, and welcome back to Tanya's Beauty Box. I am Tanya, and today we're going to be doing a collaboration with a bunch of lovely women. Um, it's the challenge of the top five foundations. In addition to that, I would also like to dedicate this particular video to my mom who passed recently on May 2nd. Her birthday is the 15th. We just had um, Mother's Day, so that was a little difficult. Um, we buried her on the 7th, and then um, again, her birthday is this coming May 15th. This video will be um, published after all of that, but I did want to dedicate this video in honor of her memory. Okay, this is going to be short and sweet because I am still kind of a little bit off um, with everything that's going on. Today is actually um, just like a week after her death, so just a little bit off, but thank you so much for bearing with me and subscribing and watching and make sure that you check out the other ladies that will be uh, participating in this particular collaboration and challenge, okay? It's a bunch of wonderful women with great channels and great content, and I hope everyone will be able to view their content and um, rate, comment, and subscribe to those channels as well. So my number five would be from the Lip Bar. This is their Skin Serum Foundation with hy Hyaluronic Acid and Iris Moss Extract. This is part of their Fast Face Kit. I am in the shade 504, and I like it because it does have this brush even though it's um, dirty right now. Um, you can remove the brush from the component and just get the, the um, get the product out or they do have now a separate tool called the brush tip it's a tip that you can just pump you pump from the bottom and squeeze out the foundation um, let me show you a color swatch of this and this is number 504 from the lip bar I like it because of the mechanism. It blends into my skin. It doesn't make me feel dry. I have normal to dry skin, so it doesn't make my skin feel taut or any of that. Number four is from Il Maquillage, and I have this Wake Up Look, Woke Up Like This foundation in number 220. And this is Il Maquillage. Okay, I like this because this is a dead on match for my skin tone. I did the little um, quiz that they had online, and this particular foundation you can get for free um, shipped to you to try out as long as you just pay for shipping. If you decide that you like it, then you will pay the entire price of the um, foundation. If you don't like it, you send it back, and you don't owe any money. So it's a, and see how that's just melted into my skin? Let's do a little swatch of this. And that is the Woke Up Like This Foundation from Il Maquillage. Okay. There we go. And I, I can say I like this. This is one of one of the only um, higher end foundations that I have, okay? Now this is, might be a little bit messy, so I might not do a um, swatch of this. This is, of course, from Maybelline. This is the Fit Me Put Matte and Poreless in the color 368, which is deep golden. And I like this because, number one, it's very affordable, probably no more than eight bucks. <clears throat> and this matches my skin as well. It performs similar to my El Maquillage as far as being spreadable and creamy and just melting into the skin and doesn't leave any lines of demarcation so I really like it but I am number 368 golden I'm sorry deep golden in a matte fit me so it's similar to this color here the woke up like this by Il Maquillage my number two foundation is the L'Oreal True Match Lumi I like it again because I have normal to dry skin so I like a little radiance to my um, face this doesn't leave a um, 
it doesn't leave it too dewy though that I look like I'm glistening and glowing but it just leaves a nice soft sheen it's more of a satin finish and it just let, let, lets your um, skin shine through I don't particularly care for full coverage foundation therefore I don't mind when foundations allow for your skin to shine through the foundation and that's what I like about this so it looks more like it's an ideal like they say ideal match true match um, to the skin so I really like it and my number one foundation is from Clinique it used to be $29 now I believe it's 32 or 31 bucks now but this is the Clinique even better makeup um, broad spectrum SPF 15 and I like it because and I'm sorry this is in the color number 19 clove I like it because Clinique is a very affordable brand for uh, foundation and it um, really melds into my skin so all of these foundations really uh, meld into my skin tone and it doesn't look like I'm wearing a mask it doesn't dehydrate my skin it doesn't leave it looking taut and and and, and dry and um, let's do a little picky poo of this so again, this is the even better. So you can see that they're all, it might be a little bit light, but once it starts to dry down, it dries down directly into my skin tone. And I really, really like that. So that is all the foundations. This is my number one foundation, the Clinique Even Better. Number two is from L'Oreal, the True Match Lumi. Number three is my Maybelline uh, Fit Me Matte and Poreless. So even though I have dry skin, this doesn't leave me um, looking cakey or anything. Number five is from Il Maquillage, the Woke Up Like This Foundation in 220. And then we have the Lip Bars Foundation in number 504. This is their Fast Face Skin Serum Foundation. Thank you so much for watching this video. And again, this is dedicated to my mother, Ellen Victoria Cook. Um, I am named after her. My name is Tanya, and her nickname is Tanya. And so she liked that name so much, she decided to name her daughter by her nickname. So in my family, nobody really knows what my first name is. Everybody calls me Michelle, which is my middle name. Um, and I'm going to suspect that's going to continue on even though my mother is no longer with us. But thank you so much for tuning in to this very short video. I wanted to make sure that I got my collab video together. Um, we're still grieving over here. We're going through the grieving process. But I did want to honor my commitment to the ladies. I am wearing on my lips um, a lipstick from Sephora called Snuggle Weather. And on top I have uh, Fenty regular Fenty Glow lip gloss and I'm really liking it it put me in the mind I guess I made my own honey waffles <laughs> but again thank you again for just taking some time out to watch this video everyone's um, description everyone's links will be down in the description um, bar in the description box um, so that you'll be able to check out the ladies alrighty thank you so much and have a great day